I'm turning green because I want to make better choices for both me and the environment. I am turning green because I want to live as sustainably as possible. Because we all have a responsibility to protect our Earth. Because I love my body and the environment. I want a more sustainable food system. For the ocean. For a sustainable future. Conscious, conscious College Road Tour. Conscious College Road Tour. From conventional to conscious. tell you about it and give you like pamphlets and stickers and free stuff and you should check it out. There's three things I need to look for when I get food. The USDA organic labeling, the non-GMO labeling, and the fair trade labeling. You just need to start doing it. Like you have to start like buying the product. You have to start like we're just figuring out using like using your own of what you have at home, figuring out what is good for your body. Feminine products that have pesticide cotton in them. I never knew about that. I didn't it's stuff that you don't think about, so it's really helping raise awareness. Your skin is a uh, organ too, so if you like, wouldn't like rub it on your liver, don't rub it on your face. Living a healthier life. That's pretty much it. <laughs> I'm still learning. What I learned today is that fragrances and also cleaning products have no regulation of what goes in them. I learned that there are a lot more students at the University of Arkansas who are interested in sustainability than I thought there were. Students, the upper tiers of this university need to know about this because we do care about the environment and the next generation sustainability and they need to know we care. There were a lot of people that showed up to the town hall meeting and they had a lot of like crazy issues that they wanted to fix on campus. It's something that we need to talk about and really need to address completely now. Since we are stakeholders but our voice isn't necessarily heard all the time, making that voice louder and louder as opposed to like the money that's really loud. They really want to see innovative things happening but they need to hear your voices. More naturally grown foods in our dining halls. And everything would be bulk products and bring your own bag. Stop selling bottled water. Have pictures or examples of what is recyclable and what isn't. They're always going to say it's not possible, but it's absolutely possible. Our culture is changing, so sustainability is now becoming attractive. And if we're really going to push for this and really going to change the culture, you have to be able to change the culture of people coming into the school. Implementing a sustainability component to new student orientations. We can make this campus someone to actually look towards as a role model. That's a good one. Turning green. Turning green. Turning green. Turning green. Dream and do. Dream and do.